Hello scrappers and e-waste lovers, this is David here from A Dave E-Waste. Um, today, as promised, on the, well we don't have a table, but on the autopsy table, we have a Hammond organ and model number is J322. Um, there's a lot of screws involved, so I've took the liberty of taking a few screws out just to kind of speed up the video. Um, okay, let's get stuck in. Actually, before we get stuck in, I'll just give you a quick run around the organ to see what you think of it. Before we take it apart, more like. And that's the front. There's not much to it. There actually, I actually, when I got it, I thought it was going to be a lot bigger. I was thinking something like, you know, church organs. <laughs> well, here we go now. Now I have some of these screws already taken apart. I'll leave that there in case I need to okay. take this off. This looks like it's uh, from the speaker setup. I'll snip some of these cables and I'll, uh, I'll give you a closer look. Nice big transformer here. Some of the speaker set up. Okay, we'll uh, delve in a little bit deeper. Put this out of the way. Now, looking in here, I have to get into these boards. I will have to take off a couple of bolts and nuts inside here. Now, sorry now, I'm trying to do this uh, organ in between the, the rain shower today, hence I'm all wet there. I picked a lovely day to do it, didn't I? Right, so I have a few more screws taken out, so. Another speaker. Another one here, nice fine big one. I think I have the screws taken here, so this just should pop out. Yeah, apart from uh, a few cables here. a bit more room for us. Now I'll tidy them up a little bit later on. Now I think I need to take this off next. Right. Nice top taken off. Some brass pieces. Always comes in handy. Now what to next? Remember them showers I was talking about? Yep. That's what we have now. So I'll have to abandon the organ teardown for today. So I'll be back. Just lovely, isn't it? That's Ireland for you. Hello and welcome back to another day where it's a little bit less wet. So we'll uh, start again at this and we'll try get stuck in. Okay, here we go. With a gentle persuasion. Just like that. Now I'll bring you over 
Let's see what goodies we see. Now this is where a lot of the good stuff is in along there. There's all them contacts for the keys. We'll try that again. But that's just a quick look. It's amazing how these things worked. Do you know this was all done in the 30s and 40s and stuff like that. I'm sorry, well this model itself was in the 19, I think it was the 1969 I think. Uh, right, we'll have a little look in. Well if anything else I'm going to have a, a nice bit of copper recovery anyway. Um, like I do a bit of gold recovery myself so I know like a good few uh, components and stuff like that but I just took a quick look in here I don't know much of this stuff so if anyone is watching and you know and you know what a lot of this stuff is please drop me a comment and uh, we'll go from here now I'll just turn that around there Now that's some of them keys from the opposite side, as you can see. It's an amazing the way these things were built. Apparently on each key of the organ, either the contacts will either be silver plated or palladium or could be gold. Or coming from each key there's a wire which I'm looking like one of these could be a palladium wire so what I'll do I'll have to strip it down a bit more and I'll have to investigate and drop uh, some of the cables in and the wires and acids and stuff and see what we have but uh, yeah that's there's not really much to it really when when uh, you start breaking it down being honest you know. I'll have a lot of work now identifying all the components what I do plan on doing in this organ is um, I'm going to recover all the the precious metals from this organ like I'm going to you know I'm going to process everything like for gold, silver, palladium, and then I'm gonna do maybe in a in a two part series, or maybe three part series. For this one is just for the breakdown. Like part two will be like uh, the circuit board breakdown and all individual components, and then part three will be um, hopefully, you know what I get out of the circuit boards, like in like gold, silver, or palladium. Um, well, that's the plan. You know yourself that could change. Now on a lighter side, let's see can I get this uh, broken down. Now we have some timber. There's not much to it really. That's your organ people. Made small work of that. Now I just have to take these few parts off and then uh, we're done. My friends, that's the organ. <laughs> now, hope you can see this now. Remember I was on about being some palladium in it? I wasn't very hopeful when I was uh, taking it apart. It's like, where is the palladium? Well, I think I found it, but it's not much, but it is palladium. Now, where are we? See these contacts here? See those little focus, focus? not focusing I'm really sorry and I see them little silver things strips 
that's the palladium, palladium I'm looking for. And there's more on the back side here, some here, and on these the whole way across. You can probably see a little bit better there now. Like there's some there, there's some there, and on the underneath, and all these the whole way across. And also, it's the same on these contacts here, all the way across, and the one there, and all the way across. And then I have all these boards to process as well. So yeah, I'll have my work cut out for me, but um, yeah, I'm glad I got it done eventually. And sorry for the wait, folks. And that's my little copper pile as well. But I still believe there's some palladium wire in this somewhere, so I won't be just throwing it into my copper pile just yet. So, there you go, guys. Um, part two will be me going through all the boards and talking about the components. And then part three, I'd say, will be see how much gold, palladium, silver, copper will get out of the whole thing. Okay, thanks for watching, guys.